What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to your home for everything local sports. It's JJ. And Mike, this high school football video is brought to you by Naples Rib Company, the perfect place to cater your team's next event. There is a bunch of stuff to be excited about if you're a Wilson Bruins football fan this year. First and foremost, field turf. It's not just the turf, though. The upgrades to the overall Cliff Meyer Athletic Facility and the Jim Arquilla track are absolutely beautiful, and they're hoping to have play a little bit more beautiful football on it this year. Yeah, coming off a disappointing year after back-to-back -back historic campaigns under head coach Mark Ziegenhagen with 14 returns turning starters, Bruins got options. Ziggy is back coaching the linebackers where his son Logan, relation, is battling for playing time. They're rededicated to defense. They gave up 28 points per game last year, which is not typical of Zig and Hagen defenses. They're going to be a lot more aggressive. No more bend but don't break. Returning starters at linebacker Ethan Moxley, Brett Dogwitz, they're going to be active in the front seven if Zig wants to be more aggressive. So guys like Guzman and Federio, returning starters at the line, Jalen Ferreira, Zig loves this junior class. They're also in the defensive secondary where Dylan Harris, Zachariah Dolphin will lead the way. They've also got a couple transfers like Rasan Moore who could play big roles. Most important returner for Wilson is the quarterback Ryan Petway. He completed 60% of his passes last year as the midseason starter. He just gets the ball out of his hands quickly, but the baseball player also has a hose and can stretch the field throwing it downfield. He had a great game, the overtime win over Lakewood last year that kind of solidified him as the starter. He's going to be looking for guys like Dolphin, Kevin Sperry, Andrew Garcia on the outside, but Wilson wants to run the ball a lot this year because they've got a good but thin offensive line and a three-headed monster at running back. At the line, it's Conrad Tejada and Monet, and in the backfield, it's senior Marcos Nottingham, Marcelino Ramos, and junior Dylan Harris. Last year, they combined for just 30 carries for 142 yards, so these guys have a lot to prove, but if they prove it, Wilson is going to be a team to watch out for. Please visit the 562.org right now to see all of the Long Beach football previews and smash that subscribe button to help support local sports coverage.